Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Freezer Burns. As always, I'm your host Greg, the Frozen Food Master, and once again you're joining me as I eat my way through the freezer aisle one box at a time. Today, I'm reviewing this. It is the Trident Seafoods The Ultimate Fish Sticks. That is a bold, bold proclamation to say the ultimate fish sticks. I'm ready to put this to the test. $5.49 a box, ready to get this out of the box. See how it looks, there's many different cooking varieties. We're gonna see how it cooks. And then most importantly, we're gonna get these ultimate fish sticks in my belly. Now I don't know a whole lot about Trident Seafoods, other than the fact that Brick once killed a man with a Trident, uh, but you know he kept his head on a swivel, which is what you need to do when, when you're in a vicious cockfight. The Ultimate Fish Sticks, zero grams trans fat, these just, they look really, really good. Don't they look good? But over $5 a box, um, they better be really, really good. The, uh, this box really speaks of high quality seafood. We're not talking Gordon's here. We're talking about something a little deeper, a little richer. Something that maybe comes from a, a better part of the ocean. We're talking about whole fillets. We're talking about, what is that? It's the Marine Stewardship Council. Well, there you go. I mean, that just, that totally uh, dispels all the anxiety I have for eating a fish stick. Now, this is the serving suggestion, which by my count looks like four fish sticks, two green grapes, and some random tartar sauce. <clears throat> but on the back, servings per container about five, serving size about three sticks. So that's pretty interesting. They say three sticks, they show you four sticks. Now what makes this the ultimate fish stick? Let's see, it says the ultimate fish stick from Trident is cut from whole fillets of snow white pollock caught in the icy clear waters of the North Pacific. There's no mince and no mystery. So we got whole fillets here. I'm ready to taste the difference. Cooking instructions. There's basically every possible way to cook this thing. Conventional oven, convection oven, microwave oven, and you can deep fry these babies. Now I know for a fact these things are gonna taste really good in the oven. I know it's gonna, whatever it tastes like in the oven, it's gonna be multiplied by two when you deep fry these suckers. We're gonna put this in the microwave and see it at its lowest common denominator as usual. Cook four sticks on high power for one and a half to three minutes. Simple instructions. Now, just in case you were wondering, again, look at this. I, I don't quite understand this. When I think of fish sticks, I don't really think of green grapes, but I guess that's how they do it with the Trident Seafoods. Let's look at the nutritional facts. Serving container, again, five. Serving size, three sticks. For every three sticks of these whole filet haddock, oh, I'm sorry, Snow White Pollock from the icy clear waters of the North Pacific, we have seven grams of total fat, 180 calories, 15 milligrams of cholesterol, 280 milligrams of sodium, 14 grams of total carbs, 14 grams of protein. Let's get this out of the box. <clears throat> See how they look. In one bag, which is nice for those of you who are schooled in the ways of fish sticks. There's a lot of crumbs here. What I can't stand is when you bust open a box and all the crumbs come out, right? But this is, this is Trident, guys. This is high quality right here. We got a plastic bag. These things are about the size of a Burger King French toast stick. Almost identical. I wouldn't even be surprised if it came from the same mold. This is about the same size, roughly four and a half inches wide, evenly breaded. These look pretty good. So when we come back, I'm gonna put this in the microwave for one and a half to three minutes. When we come back, we're gonna get this into my belly. Okay, we are back and I have cooked this in the microwave. Said one and a half to three minutes, I've been monitor monitoring it. I put it in for about two and a half minutes. Let's look at this. Now, as usual, I went with the box. 
The box says about three sticks. The box is showing me four sticks, guys. Now, I don't have the grapes, and I don't have the tartar sauce, but I do have the four sticks. So I put four sticks in. Now, I was reading the back of the box while we were uh, cooking these things up, really trying to understand why the ultimate fish stick. Now, it did say that it has more fish and less breading in every bite. Now, depending on what type of fish stick eater you are, do you care about the fish or do you care about the breading? We're going to see how this tastes. So, again, the ultimate fish stick, you know you people at Trident Seafoods and any other person out there titling frozen foods. If you're going to put a, a title that says the ultimate, you're basically challenging me, the frozen food master. I'm going to put it to the test. How does this smell? This smells really good. Um, you know, sometimes you get fish sticks and it smells way too fishy. Almost as if it's not even the natural smell of the fish. It's just a fish and then they, um, I don't know, they, maybe they spray some sort of fish perfume on it. It smells way too um, suspect to be that fishy. This smells like, like a good piece of fish. Um, and I'm not talking like fisherman's platter or uh, captain's platter at Red Lobster where they make the finest biscuits from the Cheddar Bay, I might add. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about like a real seafood piece of fish, okay? Se seafood restaurant piece of fish. Let's look at this. Now I put it in the microwave, as expected, crispy on the top, wicked soggy on the bottom. And again, like I said, we put this in the oven, uh, it's you know it's going to taste 10 times better, the consistency. You deep fry these suckers, man, it's going to be good. But I put this in the microwave because if you're going to put microwave directions on it, as always, I'm going to cook it in the microwave and show you how it tastes. Speaking of which, let's get this in my belly. It's a nice piece of fish. Okay, once again, as I said on there, it's not mince. These are whole fillets. You can taste that. Um, it's flaky on the inside. Even that one bite, you can see that flake in there. Hopefully, it'll get it in focus. Um, really good consistency. Consistency with the breading. Uh, consistency with this fish. Smells really good. Yeah, you can tell. I had my doubts. This is a high quality fish stick. It's really good stuff. Even though it was soggy, the breading stayed on the fish stick. That's good quality. That's about all I can say. These guys are good. Trident Seafoods Ultimate Fish Stick. I'll give this a four and a half stars. Five forty nine a box. It's good stuff, guys. Uh, I guess you get what you pay for. Trident Seafoods. They have a lot of stuff in the freezer. I'm looking to try some more stuff. See if this is a totally. Much props to Trident Seafood in general, or whether the ultimate fish stick is all they got, okay? But for today, we're just reviewing this, four and a half stars, $5.49 a box. As always, I'm your host, Greg, the Frozen Food Master. Got a piece of fish in my mouth. This has been another episode of Freezer Burns, and I'll see you next time.